1964, um, the Civil Rights Act was passed um, really because of the blood of many people, and particularly three young men, um, James Cheney, Andrew Goodman, and Michael Schwerner. Um, with Project Hip Hop, we take a civil rights tour every summer. Um, we take our young people down in the heat, um, 5,000 miles from here to New Orleans and back. Um, and one of the places that we visit is um, Meridian, Mississippi. Um, unfortunately, for, for my generation, for those of us who went when we were younger, I, I went the first time when I was 15, um, we had the opportunity to meet with uh, Mr. Obi Clark, who was the undertaker in Meridian, Mississippi, um, and is the person that found a place to bury James Cheney, because at the time, the families wanted, so James, Andrew Goodman and Michael Schroeder were, were both white from New York City, and James Cheney was from Meridian, and the families wanted the three of them to be buried together, but it was against the law, even in death, to bury white and black people together. In addition, James Cheney was denied the opportunity to be buried in his hometown because they said he had brought disgrace upon the town by being part of the Civil Rights Movement. Um, and so Opie Clark did the work of finding him a place to be buried, and unfortunately he has never been able to be at rest um, because his grave continues to be used for target practice. Um, every time we go down there, it's been vandalized in some form, uh, and that continues to this day. Um, and so, um, it's really important to recognize that all of these games, unfortunately, were paid for with blood. 